sitting here in the dark. Today is Monday and it's a Vlogmas day number 12. <laughs> I just love sometimes when Liam is um, asleep and I can get like um, me time kind of so early in the morning. So I just had a, a nice warm hot bath with bubbles, made myself a cup of tea and I'm just gonna chill really until he wakes up. It's pretty gross outside, but all the snow is gone, it's raining now and as you can see it's still quite dark but I think it may be that kind of sky this morning rather than you know being late. I don't even know what time it is anyway. So what's on the agenda today? I do need to do some work on the vlog, I've been saying it for so long but you know what the plan was to do it on Sunday but I just got so excited about the snow and I really want to kind of enjoy it you know have that proper kind of cozy snowy Sunday and because Ty had Liam as well out again it was one of those quite luxury moments for me when I'm uh, for a while on my own in the house and yeah like watching nice movies I've seen even hundred times but I know I've got to put me in a nice mood and you know the baking and just really some alone time so that was really nice and today I'm gonna obviously wait for Liam to wake up I need to wait for my hair to dry you know I love to if I can to leave it dry naturally and then obviously gonna put my makeup on and then I want to go and get some Christmas cards and I, I see how I get on, I may actually write a few today because um, I always send out so many so it's good to kind of do it either in phases or just kind of be prepared and tonight I've got an event, a Christmas event with Jo Malone so that should be amazing, they always throw really really lovely uh, parties and events um, and it's literally an amazing brand um, you know how much I love their products and them as a brand I love the team as well so yeah I'll take you along to that and yeah this is this is pretty much the plan um, so work spending time with Liam running a few errands and today is gonna be the big giveaway I haven't decided yet how I'm gonna run this but I'll probably leave it open for a few days rather than just 24 hours like the hour like the others and I'm thinking because it's going down so well that I may do um, I may do basically maybe give away around Christmas time another one I don't know let's see let's see how we're gonna get on and uh, but I think you guys deserve it for sure and I absolutely love the engagement you leave comments you following so yeah thanks so much and yeah for me it's time to chill and I'll see you a little bit later there's noises coming out of Liam's bedroom hey hey you excessively spin Camilachko Guys, I realized it's meant to rain pretty much all day today and I wanted to go to uh, quite big Sainsbury's just to kind of have options and get a few bids as well uh, but I'm not gonna do it because I need to go in the rain uh, a little bit further with the buggy so I'm just gonna pop into the local Sainsbury's get a few bids and maybe I'll get the the mission for the Christmas cards to go around shops although we do have a nice shop uh, quite close to my house um, with Christmas cards no but I'll see I, I'll see how we get on but it doesn't look promising and I just checked the forecast and yeah it's meant to rain like big time today so um, I guess it's gonna be another day at home yeah oh well no point dragging Liam in the rain for uh, long trips or anything like that and juggle the umbrella at the same time I guess uh, I really have to start like drive here I do have a driving license but I'm terrified to drive on the do you know what I say to Tyke I'm always like drive on the wrong side <laughs> because I think majority of the countries drive obviously on the right side well here and the colonies they will drive on the left and uh, I made this joke basically that 
you know, driving on the left side is the wrong side. <laughs> Sorry guys if I offended you. Postman was just here and every time he rings the bell, like Liam just gets crazy because he knows I'll take him kind of to the main corridor and open the door and he just loves it and then he smiles at him anyway. <laughs> so these two things came. I actually cannot believe all the good stuff that is in here. So you probably remember one of my vlogmases I went to the Rodial makeover. And there were some products I don't have yet and I absolutely enjoyed um, and they used. So one is this rose gold serum, um, which is um, I think one of their new newish products. Um, I absolutely love the foundation brush they used, um, just the texture of it and uh, obviously how the skin looked after using this. Um, this is so beautiful. It's like very, very neutral and very natural. It's kind of like a lipstick, but more kind of like a crayon style lipstick. Um, and then the contouring powder, which I have not used, and also they send me the um, uh, Edge Brown uh, eyebrow pencil. That was really, really good. Um, yeah, so thank you so much, Rodial. So this is the first delivery. And I also got, like, which I can't believe, more stuff from the lovely Dolce & Gabbana beauty team. Um, so there's some eye crayons, this foundation which is probably matched to me based on whatever they use at the makeover. If you haven't seen that Vlogmas video definitely go and have a look. And there's a little note um, that says thanks for joining us in Herald's Enjoy the Enclosed. I will definitely enjoy Super productive morning. So I've been sorting out the giveaways. This is the pile that needs to be sent. I already have the addresses. This is the pile I need to uh, do a draw and I just prepared the giveaway that you will see later on, the final really big giveaway, including the Aspinall bag, which you can enter guys today. Uh, so stay tuned for this vlog. So guys, this is the final giveaway. I may still do uh, one more, but I wanted to show you what you'll be able to win and all the information how to win because it's going to be a little bit more work because there's so much good stuff is going to be in um, inserted in the description box below. So we've got this gorgeous Aspinall bag which comes with a chain so you can wear it actually over the shoulder. So just this is worth £185. It comes obviously in the gift box. We've got this Emmy Australia earmuffs. That's a sheepskin, really, really gorgeous. A cosmetic bag or makeup bag by Clinique. We've got this gift book by Vita Liberata, which is a luxury tan. We've got this gorgeous eye palette by Clarence, La Roche Posay anti aging concentrate. We've got a pixie uh, lip balm or lipstick. We've got the famous banana low lighter by Rodial. We've got a Clinique. Um, high impact mascara and two Miss Sicily lipsticks by Dolce Gabbana. So this is a super generous. Please enter the giveaway. It's going to be open for a few days and there's going to be reminders in each kind of upcoming vlogmases. So make sure you read the description box below and enter to win all this amazing stuff. Oh, the weather, <laughs> weather is something else today. Um, Liam is currently helping me in the kitchen by helping, uh, I mean, opening all the cupboards, taking the stuff out. Well, there's only one cupboard at the moment or two he can open because we don't have enough of those um, safety locks. Uh, I'm actually cooking a vegetable soup for us for lunch and then I put on some Mexican chicken like recipe I found. Uh, put it in the slow cooker so it should be on for seven hours and I can actually show you. So the soup is almost done. Is the Mexican chicken. I don't know if you can hear anything because the washing machine is on, the dishwasher's on, and Liam is such a yum. Liam just had a yogurt for snacks. I don't think he will eat yet, but later, and at least it can cool down. This is so good for you guys. I'm so happy that I cooked this. I just tried on this lipstick, Charlotte Tilbury Penelope, but I'm not sure about this shade on me. It's kind of washing me out, don't you guys think? Yeah, that's... I do love Amazing Grace. That's, I think, one of my favorites from Charlotte Tilbury. But this one, I don't think we're gonna be good friends. It's kind of like cold, 
yeah, I'm just too pale for it and like blonde hair. It just doesn't work. Maybe if I would have like a really striking eye makeup or something. Yeah, but I just want to have a look what I could wear tonight to the Joe Malone. It's basically like uh, the crazy color for Christmas pop-up. So, not sure whether, probably not dressed up and also looking at the weather. I'm not sure if I want to wear like a skirt or a dress, but let's think of something. Let me show you what I decided to wear. I went for the safe kind of like black option because yeah I really feel like I need new clothes but that will be probably a story for another vlog so I'm wearing this super old just very simple t-shirt and buttons up with some necklaces this is from my friend Olena that uh, has got a brand called Sophia's earrings these are River Island these earrings are can you see from Olena as well she does amazing stuff I think Pippa Middleton wore a few of her uh, pieces and then I'm wearing this old Topshop skirt, which is like a brocade uh, with like lace trim. These uh, duo boots and I'm gonna wear the Chloe bag and I'm gonna wear Barrett and that girl on lipstick because I just love it. Yeah, you know, I'm a lippy girl and I'm gonna just uh, wear it with this kind of camel coat. It's not kind of camel coat, it is a camel coat and that's by Armani Exchange. So this is the total look. And I really like it, you know? You can't go wrong with camel and neutral tones and black. So let's go! Gosh, this lipstick really got me. I love it so much. What a gorgeous shade. Like, perfect for winter. It's even really nice in this light. Okay, challenge number one. Let's get me to the John Malone event. Um, you know what? Like, I love London so much, but... You know, there's like 10 snowflakes and the transport just collapses. <laughs> what are the Russians supposed to do? <laughs> anyway, let's not complain. I'm gonna get there. It's all okay. Let's go. Is. So it should be good. I went to I think one or two events there before and a few meetings and I, the gorgeous office. When you and me deck the halls, making everything look just like it should at Jules. You know this street I'm on, it has got like really lots of like cute restaurants and bars. And like in the winter when it gets really cold, I'm such a freak. I always look at the people inside, how cozy they look, and I want to join them. It's so stupid, but honestly, it just looks so cozy from the outside. Oh god, there's so... Like, I feel like there's so many. Like, oh, um, Jake 
Jake Gyllenhaal. Oh yeah. And Tom Hardy. Yeah. And oh yeah. Yeah. Tom Hardy. Idris Elba. Those are like my top three. Okay. Yeah. And who is your fashion icon? Ooh, that's a bit tricky. I love. Okay, you can uh, say three fashion icons. Um, I'm oh not the pressure. Model wise. Okay. Oh my goodness. You know what? I love the Austin Twins and what they did. Yeah. Um, because they were very commercial in the beginning, but then they started this business and you know, it's new. Really, I think always so expensive for minimal stuff, but it's like really, really good, yeah. like good, good stuff. Um, and you know, I love all the French girls. I think they're just super chic and cool and effortless. Um, I can't believe it's hard. <laughs> so designers, designers. I love Saint Laurent. Um, that, like, that's my aesthetic. Jack Moose. p.m. Get cozy, put on PJs, and yeah, just enjoy the rest of the evening. So, guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button, and uh, see you in my next video.